New at five, just over 4,300 miles, members of the Colbert County High School Band will embark on a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Tomorrow morning, they'll travel to Hawaii to take part in the annual Pearl Harbor Memorial Parade. As Way 31's Marie Waxel explained, this is a trip just over a year in the making. I really don't know if they actually believe we're still going. Last Thanksgiving, they received the initial invite, something they never thought was possible without the guidance of band director Logan Pouncey. They wanted to do something new, something better, and they started pushing themselves and buying into the program. In just a few short years, Pouncey gave new life to a nearly dormant program. They realize it's fun to be good. These kids have put in the extra work to make their community proud. In addition to preparing for Hawaii, they've been putting in the extra work to continue to excel for marching competition season and during football season on the field, giving it their all. We're known around here for a tradition of excellence. We may not be the largest band, but we will always look the best and be the best we can be. Mm -hmm. um, and everybody knows, and I think they trust us now. They have this, this trust in us that we will go over and represent Leeton and the Shoals very well as an ambassador. Taking part in something much bigger than themselves. Freedom is not free. And it takes a lot to be able to just take a group of kids to Hawaii to do this concert, to do this parade, be able to meet servicemen that were still alive then, to, to remind them that this, this is the greatest honor that our, our town could have for a long time. This will probably be the last chance that anyone can meet World War II vets that were alive, especially in Pearl Harbor. Marie Waxel, Way 31 News.